What's up everyone, Jay Smith Jordans here and today we're going to do something different. I'm going to show you guys all my Jordan 5's in my collection. And But before we get into it, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Give this video a like if you like it and follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Jay Smith Jordans. Now for the first pair I'm going to show you guys, <clears throat> we got the Jordan 5 Fresh Prints. These are really nice. I like them. I like the story behind them. They didn't come with shoelaces or anything like that because in the TV show, Will Smith didn't wear shoelaces in his uh, Jordan 5s. So I get the story. It's got really nice material on them. I don't have the grapes, the OG grapes in my collection. So I definitely wanted to pick these up. I was happy that they put uh, the Nike Air on the back of them. But these are really nice. The material is really nice on them. And uh, yeah, it's the first pair I wanted to show you guys. So for the second pair, we got the Jordan 5 Satin Breads. These are really nice. These are going uh, below retail right now, which is really surprises me because I think they're fire myself. I love the colors on them and I love the satin on them. It looks really nice. <clears throat> So material wise, I like the material on them. They're covered with the satin. You have your 3M at the top of the tongue and then the red and the black, it just pops if you ask me. And of course, <clears throat> I love the bottom sole, how it's got that icy sole with the red going through it, definitely pops. But anyways, your Jordan 5 satin breads. We have your Jordan 5 Michigans. These are really nice. I definitely don't like Michigan as a sport team. I am uh, live in Ohio, so I'm definitely a Buckeyes fan. But as far as the shoes, these shoes are fire. The material on them are really nice. They definitely did a good job with the new buck on here. It's a very clean new buck. And uh, <clears throat> they're very close to the Tokyo 5s. And I'll never have the Tokyo 5s in my collection, so this will probably be the closest pair that I get to them. So I definitely had to pick it up. And I also like the patchwork that they got on the bottom, on the back of the hill. I think it's a nice touch, something different. And of course, you got your 3M at the top of the tongue, like all the other Jordan 5s. But these are your Jordan 5 Michigans. Next pair, we have your Jordan 5 Laney's. These are fire, in my opinion. Another shoe that you can get uh, below retail. I love any Jordan 5 that they put the number 23 on the side of them. I just think it's a nice touch to them. For those who don't know, Laney is the high school that Michael Jordan went to. And this is the school colors on the shoe. Uh, they did a really good job material-wise. I love the new buck material on them. The blue's nice. I definitely like the color blue <clears throat> with the hits of yellow going through it. So I was definitely happy to put these in my collection. These are your Jordan 5 Laney's. Next pair, you have your Jordan 5 International Flight. These are not. These are definitely nice. I guess they're okay. They wouldn't be one of my top uh, five Jordan 5's out of my collection or anything like that. <clears throat> but I like the colors. I like how the orange and blue pops. But as far as material, it does look like it's got some tumbled material on it. But the material does feel kind of rubbery if you ask me. But other than that, I didn't have very many Jordan 5's in my collection. So I, so I picked these up to put them in my collection and now I'm not going to sell them because they're way below retail from what I bought them. So I'll just keep them in my collection for now and see how they go. But anyways, your Jordan 5 International Flight. Next, we have one of my favorite Jordan 5s out of my collection. You got your Jordan 5 PSGs. These are really nice. The detail on here is crazy. And the material on here is really, really nice. <clears throat> they definitely put some uh, time and effort into these shoes. They're, they're very clean. And like I said, they got crazy details on them. As you see, you got the Paris behind the screening on the side panel. You got the 3M at the top of the tongue. And then you got your Paris logo on the back of the heel. They're just a really nice uh, Jordan 5. A lot of people didn't get them if they had the metallic 5s already because they said that it uh, resembled the Jordan 5 metallics. I don't have those in my collection, so these were a must. And I'm glad I got them. That way I have uh, the Jordan 5s and the Jordan 6 PSGs and the Jordan 1 High PSGs. So it's nice to have the collection. But yeah, these are definitely one of my top uh, Jordan 5s in my collection in my opinion. Next one, we have your Jordan 5 Wings. These are one of my kids' uh, favorite pair of Jordan 5s. These are pretty cool. I like how they took uh, pictures that kids drew and put it all over the shoe. And another cool fact is that no shoe is the same. Like, they didn't put the pictures in the same place on every shoe. They're all different. So that's pretty cool. Another cool thing about them is every, everywhere where you see this green, like on the side panel, and the lace lock holders, they all glow in the dark. So I think that's an awesome touch. But these are really nice your Jordan 5 wings the material on here is uh, butter they definitely did a great job with these sneakers they put some really good nice material on here I like them they will definitely stay in my collection and here they are your Jordan 5 wings
for the last pair these are definitely my favorite pair out of my collection in Jordan 5's you have your Jordan 5 trophy rooms and these are fire they have a decent uh, suede wrapped around it it's not do new buck it's definitely suede and it's just I love the uh, light blue color that they used on it it's got killer details all over it you got your 23 stitched on the side on the other sneaker you got the number 5 stitched on the side and that's uh, actually his kids uh, school number or uh, sport number that he used but yeah these are fire price uh, prices are going up with these last time I checked they're around 1500 they were going for and there wasn't very many pairs there were 7,000 pairs and all together made of this sneaker so uh, the value definitely will keep going up on these <clears throat> and like I said the detail on these is crazy you have the Jordan on the bottom of this sole and then you have the trophy room logo on the bottom of this hole, which is really cool. But the material is crazy nice on here. These are definitely the nicest, uh, the nicest Jordan 5 I have in my collection. But anyways, this is all the Jordan 5s I have in my collection as of right now. So I wanted to share it with you guys. And plus, I want to start getting more videos out there for you guys to watch. So I hope you enjoyed this. <clears throat> and uh, if you did, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Stay safe, and I'll see you guys on the next one.